पाकिस्तानी ऑक्यूपाइड जम्मू कश्मीर एंड पाकिस्तानी ऑक्यूपाइड गिलगित बल्तिस्तान वॉन्ट्स फ्रीडम फ्रॉम द ऑक्यूपेशन ऑफ पाकिस्तान स्पेशली द यूथ इन बोथ ऑक्यूपाइड टेरिटरीज आर नाउ नॉट ओनली क्वेश्चनिंग पाकिस्तान ऑक्यूपेशन बट आर लुकिंग फॉरवर्ड टू ज्वाइन द रिपब्लिक ऑफ इंडिया On the 30th of January, it was decided at an all-party conference held in Nakyal in Punch that from the 11th of February, the new wave of protests is going to hit the streets in POJK. On the 30th of January, it was decided at an all-party conference held in Nakyal in Punch that from the 11th of February, the new wave of protests is going to hit the streets in POJK. It was decided that if Pakistan does not reinstate the subsidies that are our right according to UN Charter, then there will be protests all over the occupied territories. These include rehabilitation of uh, our subsidies uh, of electricity, of wheat quotas, of uh, uh, planting trees and infrastructure development and water. The situation is very grim in Pakistani occupied Jammu Kashmir because when Pakistan occupied uh, these parts, the land mass was covered with 42% of forests. But today they are even less than 14% of forests left in POJK because the Pakistan military in collaboration with the local uh, forestry department and timber mafia in Gujranwala and Lahore have cut uh, a lot of trees, uh, almost 100,000 trees a year have been cut down and sold in the markets of Gujranwala and Lahore. There is no electricity. Uh, in POJK, there is a lot of load shedding. On, on top of that, Pakistan has withdrawn the subsidy given to us by the United Nations, the subsidy on electricity, which means that electricity prices are going to skyrocket. So in every city of POJK, a new wave of dissent is uh, brewing. And uh, we will see that after the 11th of February, there will be a new wave of protests against Pakistan, uh, Pakistani uh, atrocities. We 
we have been protesting for the past 75 years but now these protests are turning into demands of freedom pakistani occupied jammu kashmir and pakistani occupied gilgit baltistan wants freedom from the occupation of pakistan pakistan cannot deliver because our relationship with pakistan is a colonial relationship it's not a relationship of equals pakistan is an occupier and we are the oppressed therefore people especially the youth in both uh, occupied territories are now not only questioning pakistan's occupation but are looking forward to join the republic of india so that gilgit baltistan can become uh, connected with ladakh and we the people of pojk can reunite with jammu and kashmir